Hiya fishy folks and welcome back to Michael's Fish Room. Today, a micro unboxing. Grab your snack and beverage but make it small because it's a small box. Boom! Alright fishy folks, welcome back. If you guys could do me a favor, just, you know, massage the subscription button if you haven't done so already. And then get really close and rub the notification bell. And maybe, maybe talk real nice and soft to it. It likes that, trust me. Anyway folks, we have an order here from uh, my buddy Keith at KJE Aquatics. You can get in contact with Keith through Facebook, his, uh, his page, KJE Aquatics. Keith is a local online retailer and I say local because he's not a big company it's just him uh, and I know that at least one of his sons who's a very good young man very nice young man uh, helps out sometimes but Keith and I go back a couple years uh, we met through Facebook and through uh, different auctions and stuff he's in upstate New York and uh, anytime we can get together we do because he's a great guy he's much like me he tells it like it is he doesn't really have much of a filter and that's why I get along with him so Keith specializes in plants, but he does have some rare live bearers as well as other things for the fish room, some dry goods and uh, stuff like that. So um, I get all my plants from Keith. He said, hey, I'm sending you a box. Try it out. Do an unboxing. Let me know. So uh, full disclosure here, I didn't pay a dime for this. So here we go. Let's open it. We got the mat knife. By the way, Keith sent this priority to me and... Uh, I got it in two days, which is pretty good, because priority has been really slow lately. All right, we got some newspaper. Look at how well packed this is. Let's see, we got, we got the KJE stickers, which I have all over the fish room, and the pens. He loves the pens. And a little care package for my little buddy. Let's read this. Water Sprite times three. Float or plant the species works well outside as well. Works well outside as well. Crypt, loose, uh, 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 crypt loosens, clump potted, leave in the pot or plant into substrate. Brazilian pennywort, float or plant into substrate, work well outside also. Hornwort, float it. Red tiger lotus potted, keep in pot or plant into substrate, be gentle. This is a true red plant that does not need high light, will get pretty big. That's what she said. Uh, Zoomed Spirulina 20 Flake, one of the staples used at KGE, and of course, we sell it in bigger jars. Zoomed Cano Cyclops, excellent fry food and small fish, refrigerate once open. See, that's the thing, Keith. That's why I don't like it, because either I feed it all at once or I forget about it in the fish room and it stinks. But anyway, Keith and I had a conversation about the San Francisco Bay brand uh, freeze dried Cyclops powder, which I love, by the way. There'll be a link down below. Uh, Amazon, I think, is sold out of it, thanks to yours truly. But you know, um, yeah. Thrive 500 milliliter pump, the best all-in-one plant fertilizer on the market. Put the CCAM and API away forever. Enjoy and hope this does well for you. Let me know how you like those foods. Have a nice day. Love Keith, hugs and kisses. He didn't write hugs and kisses, but I know he meant it. All right, so he told me what everything was. And then he labels it as well, Water Sprite, a.k.a. Indian Water Fern, three plants. Nice. We got the horn wart. Keith and I are trying to figure out something that he can sell for all you guppy guys that can't grow java moss. Brazilian penny wart. Look at the nice packing. Oh, we got something over here. Oh, this is the Crypt Lucens. Spirulina. I've tried this actually. Can o Cyclops. That can I'll probably go in my, oh, I'll feed that into my fish room in one one uh, one go round if you know what I'm saying. This is the Red Tiger Lotus Potted, can leave in pot or plant into substrate. And then he has this cool stuff. The best 
thrive. Look, it says the best. It's not focusing. How about over here? The best. Look, the best. All right. I like this box and I like this packing. I'm going to keep it and probably reuse it because I'm cheap and I like to recycle. All right, fishy folks. Let's take a better look here. Zoomed Cano Cyclops. It doesn't smell like I thought it was going to. That's good. Gotta be careful with the cans because... There. can o cyclops See? And it comes with, with this handy foldable spoon. Alright, I gotta be honest. This little foldable spoon might be the coolest thing I've ever seen. It's like an engineering marvel right there. You know in Japan, speaking of engineering marvels, they have ketchup and mustard packets that are one. That they're like this, right? The ketchup and mustard. And you fold it in half and it snaps. And you get the perfect amount of ketchup and mustard for your American dog or hot dog as, as they are over there. Alright, let's, let's feed some of this stuff and see what it looks like. I've used this actually, I think. I can't remember. I know I've used this spirulina powder or spirulina flake. Zoom in likes to give it away at uh, at shows. And we got the Thrive. I'm going to use this outside, I think, uh, and upstairs in the planted tank. And I'm going to, let's open the horn wart. I got some fishies coming in today, actually, from a, uh, a breeder. Well, they should be here today. We'll see if they actually make it today. And uh, we'll use this in his tank, in the tank with his fish. This bag is huge, buddy. This bag is huge. So, how's everyone doing during the quarantine? My work has just been extended. My quarantine, or my work from home order, has just been extended until the middle of May. Hornwort, oh yeah, 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 I know hornwort. Three huge bunches. I'm gonna unrubber band it. I'm gonna de-band it. We gotta get the scissors though. And we're gonna float it. We'll probably use these in some of the ponds too. All right, well there's a lot here. We're gonna put it in this tank. See how it does. By the way folks, I'm gonna be doing a video on Java Maw soon. It was suggested to me by a subscriber. How do I grow Java Maw so well? because I do grow the hell out of it. Um, so look forward to that. Well, look for that, not look forward to that. You could look forward to it, but look for it. Okay, this is a big bunch, so I'm gonna split it up a little bit, put most of it in the tank next door, and then put some down there with the Snow Whites. The Snowflake Guppies for all you snowflakes out there. All right, clean the table. Uh, this is gonna go upstairs. This is gonna go upstairs. What is this water sprite? What did he say about the water sprite? Does well outside. Float it. I'm gonna float it and we're gonna get it ready for outside. I like these bags he gets from Tropical. So a couple of you guys have asked why I don't sell plants and he's the reason basically. I, there's enough business for me Oh yeah, I floated this before. It does do better when it's potted, but I'm gonna float it for now. Um, he's one of the reasons, because there's enough business, I have enough guppy and pleco business um, to take care of everything I need. I don't need to add plants. It's just another thing I would have to do. Right now, I'm pretty much at my limit with the guppies and the plecos. Last week was my best week ever. The week before that was, Eve was the second best week ever. You know what I'm saying? It was good, and then this week is better, and hopefully next week will be better. I don't know if it's because of the uh, the quarantine, everyone's at home just clicking and buying stuff or not, but it's getting to a point where most of my day Sunday is prepping, and you know I bring 20, 25 boxes every week to the post office. Luckily, they love me there, so. Okay. All right, fishy folks, let's feed some of this uh, the Cyclops. I'm gonna move the camera and show you what it's like. All right, fishy folks, here is the Zoomed 
can o cyclops I thought it would smell, it doesn't smell. It does have to be refrigerated after you open it. And uh, we're just gonna put a little bit in. These are the Mosaic Dumbo, sorry. These are the Dumbo Red Mosaic Firework Guppies. Oh yeah, they like it. They like it so much. And uh, I got these from Tamed Waters. And um, Phil over at Tamed Waters has some really high quality um, kind of designer guppies. If you guys uh, are looking for that kind of stuff, check him out on Facebook. I know he uh, he sells out quite a bit once he releases his guppies from quarantine when he gets them because they're all imports. Uh, he sells out rather quickly, so you got to check him out. I fed pre uh, most of the tanks, at least four of the tanks over here. Oh, I'm going to feed up here the blue tux grow outs. They've been growing fantastic since I've been home and feeding them uh, three to four times a day. The um, powdered cyclops and smartemia from um, cobalt. Wow, I just had a brain for it. From cobalt, they've been, I mean, they're doubling in size every week. It's fantastic. All right, guys, this stuff does have a tiny bit of a smell to it. So if you're uh, if you're smell challenged, you may not want to want to grab it. But I mean, the fish are really going crazy for it, and it's quite healthy. Let's see. Crude protein, 27%. That's that's less than I thought, but anyway, folks, that does it for my unboxing of super plants from my buddy Keith at KGE Aquatics. Don't forget to check Keith out at kgeaquatics.com as well as. My website, Michael's Fish Room. See ya. Keith and I had a conversation about the um, sensitive. Sen <laughs>